Hey guys, Gong Rong Zong here. As you can see, I fully embrace the Panda Law Walker theme that you guys have dubbed me as. I'm still very much camera shy, so I'll be using this nice fluffy head for the long foreseeable future. But more on that later. Okay, this video is gonna be twofold. First and foremost, to thank you, each and every one of you that has subscribed, watched, commented, or interacted with the videos on this channel in any way, shape, or form. You are what inspires me to continue creating such content, and I really couldn't be happier doing it for you guys. Secondly, I would also just like to share who I am and some of my own beliefs with you, just so that you can get to know me better, the Asian panda whom you're watching on YouTube, and perhaps you might share in some of the same beliefs too. There's also going to be a giveaway at the end, but it's only going to make sense within the context of the video, so make sure you watch the whole thing when you can. So, thank you. From the bottom of my heart, really thank you. I had initially planned to create a 1000 subscriber thank you video, but I had only anticipated for this to happen like many many months from now. I don't often check what the subscriber number is, and before I knew it, one day I logged in and it was already way past that. I am just extremely grateful for all of you to take the precious time of your day to enjoy some wild wow content from me and I will never ever take your time for granted. The last thing I would want is for you to feel as though you know, you've wasted your time watching one of the videos. And the amount of positive feedback I've received so far is, is really astounding. For years I was hesitant to start on YouTube due to the stereotypical you know, toxic culture that exists online and that perhaps my accent might come across as difficult to understand. But so far, other than the very occasional racist comment, it has been great feedback from you guys. Even from my very first few you know, beginning videos where the microphone is all messed up, I hardly got any negative feedback for them. So again, thank you. Thank you very much. I really appreciate all of your positivity and it's what keeps me going every day. I do also read every single one of your comments and I appreciate each and every one very very much. I also respond to almost all of them, uh, I, can I can confidently say at least 90%. Sometimes I don't because it's not really a comment I can reply to, like it's a one-liner statement of the sort, which is fine. And still thank you very much for those comments, but in that case sometimes I just leave a little heart so you know that you know I've seen it and I appreciate it. I also apologize if sometimes I take a long time to reply because you know of the time difference and sometimes when I wake up I have to rush out of the house and all. But I will read your comments and I will reply if there's something constructive I can say. YouTube to me is never just about presenting a video to you. It's all about building a friendship with you or generating a discussion about a particular topic. And those of you who've been commenting a lot of my videos, I have seen you. I actually took the time to compile some of you that have been giving me really great comments all the way from the very beginning. I'm going to leave that at the end as it's going to get a little lengthy but be sure to watch it as I want to personally thank each and every one of you. Okay, so now on to me. If you haven't guessed it yet, I'm actually from Singapore, hence the accent. I never actually thought I sounded like a panda. Uh, I am Chinese by race but I do actually sound very different from actual Chinese people from China, if you've heard them before. And anyway, I didn't actually want to clickbait you with the title, even though it is April Fools. I am going to show you my face. And honestly, I'm actually pretty terrified to do this. I'm extremely camera shy and just very introverted and shy in general. This panda mask actually really helps a lot in empowering me with a certain level of confidence in front of the camera and so I'm definitely going to be wearing it for the foreseeable future. But anyway, here goes. I'm going to show you my face but with another video. So here I am. Yeah, I actually made this video quite a while back. Yup, that's me drawing Illidari tattoos on myself and jumping around like a monkey. So you know for sure that I'm like a full-fledged wow nerd. I'll leave a link in the description below for the full video if you want to check it out. I did this video a while back while I was trying very hard to combine my two loves of fitness and gaming together. But you know, it got complicated, life got in the way, I was too busy at work and so on. So I left it 
and decided to just start this channel that focuses on the actual game itself. And I think it's better that way. I just want to say that I'm legit blindfolded doing this workout and I couldn't see a damn thing. So all in all, I'm just this really introverted, shy gamer that lives in his mom's basement and enjoys working out. Well, not really basement, I live in the attic, so it's different. I love my mom and dad very much. So why do I make World of Warcraft videos? Well, WoW has been, for me, a key part of my life. It encompassed a good part of my childhood, a great part of my adulthood, and will continue to play a big role in it for years to come. And I think many of you share the same sentiment. You know, we've all been touched by this game in one way or another, allowing it to become so much more than just a game. I believe that this is truly a magical world, a world where countless friendships are forged, where families are built, where supportive communities can be established. I believe that this is a journey many years in the making that has managed to form nothing but great memories for all of us, from our very first level 1 characters to our longtime mains all decked out in shiny epics. I believe that more so than a game, Azeroth has become a way of life of sort for all of us, not as a form of gaming addiction, but as an amazing experience that we all find joy partaking in together. We may take breaks from Azeroth, but we never do truly leave it, and I can't really say the same of any other game. And what I hope to do is to share that experience with all of you, to spread a sense of magic, a touch of positivity, a place where we can escape to when we're down and out almost like the closet in the attic in Narnia. Not in terms of a denial of real life, but a fantastic place that we can step into and experience together. So, more so than just a game, spreading positivity is a huge thing for me. More so than just a game, I believe in using it as a sort of common ground to motivate and help other gamers, just as others have done before for me. More so than a game, I want to be able to support you guys in your real lives, whether it be as a good friend, you know, or just a simple listening ear. I know so far that I've been doing a lot of lore videos, but more so than just a lore channel, a gameplay channel, or a guide channel, it's my hope that this channel's content will be able to put a smile on your face at the end of a long day. So I am going to try and merge that in, whether it be in terms of a little bit of motivation, a small pick-me-up, or perhaps even a life lesson that could help you through whatever struggles you may be facing. I did a video just recently about WoW heroes that inspired me, and that video very much encompasses what I mean about using WoW as a medium for all of us to support one another. If you haven't seen it yet, consider giving it a watch. It may be able to give you that little bit of extra push you need during the dark times. So with that said, as a last bit, I'd just like to share some of my future plans with you. If you think you've got any ideas at all to improve upon them, definitely let me know. Your feedback is always appreciated. I am going to start doing live streams, yep, and I'm going to be calling it the Panda Podcast. Uh, yeah, that's kind of the name that I came up with. I'm not entirely sure what structure it's going to take exactly, but I do know I would like to do one of them on Mondays, Mondays being the crappiest day of the week for most of us, and to do a motivational, you know, feel-good, supportive kind of stream that will help out in brightening your day. Motivational Mondays, yeah. So it's going to be a little different from the law heavy videos I've always been doing, but I'm quite excited to explore this new form of content. I think more importantly, live streaming would allow me to interact with you guys on a much more personal level too which is something I can't do as well with the normal types of videos. In line with that, I'm also thinking of doing a TIL style live stream, either for WoW lore, real life facts, or perhaps you know a blend of both. More of a casual tune-in for you guys to learn something interesting. That one's probably going to happen on Thursdays, so maybe I can call those TIL Thursdays or something. As you've probably seen, I am also pretty big on fitness in my personal life and I think it's definitely something I can help to contribute to the gaming world. So I'll be planning to do a live stream of that, discussing any potential fitness related topics you might have on Fridays. Probably call it Fitness Fridays or something, I'm not very good at these names. But hey, whatever works, yeah? 
Honestly though, I have no idea how I'm going to find the time to cope with the added live stream plus the current video content as the editing for the current videos already takes up quite a bit of time but for you guys, I'll try to find a way. So stay tuned for all of these coming up, I'm pretty excited for them and I'll probably be starting this next week or the week after. And yes, very important too, before I talk about the giveaway, I will be starting a Patreon page. I never actually considered it until one of you guys messaged me privately and asked me if I was starting one and would like to be my first supporter. I am not going to mention your name here but you know who you are and thank you very very much for that. It is definitely my dream to do this full time and I think Patreon will be the way to go for now. I have not even been able to monetize this channel yet. I actually applied for monetization all the way back in February but after all the Logan Paul stuff went down, YouTube is just taking forever to approve monetization of channels. They told me they'll get back to me by the end of April so almost three months just to monetize a channel but even then it's really very very little that you can earn from ad revenue. Every one dollar contributed by someone on Patreon would essentially need that same person to contribute about 1000 views on the YouTube channel to earn the same amount from ad revenue. Plus it's not a sustainable form of income as YouTube can just take it away whenever they want. Not saying that I dislike YouTube, I really love the platform, just stating the facts as they are. However, I am not in any way going to treat Patreon like a charity or donation. To me, it's a platform whereby I can give back to you guys just as much value as you give to me. It's a place where I believe in making a mutually beneficial exchange, so be sure to check out the rewards there if you're keen on supporting this panda on his journey. And again, thank you very much in advance for considering me. Okay, so now on to the giveaway. I don't just want to give you some generic gaming mouse or keyboard or something. This is my very first giveaway and you guys are the very first people who are supporting me. So I really want to thank you. There is this really cool company that is able to turn drawings into plushies. I'll leave a link in the description below if you'd like to check the company out. So I had a great idea of turning one of your WoW characters into a plushie. That's right, such a good idea. I even want to do it for myself now. But no, you guys get to do it first. So one of you lucky guys is going to be able to get your main character turned into a plushie. I uh, just want to state here, I'm in no way affiliated with this company. I just love the concept of what they're doing. So all you've got to do to win is to share any one of my videos on any social media platform of your choosing. It can be Reddit, it can be Facebook, it can be Twitter, whatever. And the contest is going to run for two weeks. Don't worry, I'll leave all the dates and details of the contest in the description below. After which, you just need to send me a screenshot of the post and its number of likes. And the one with the most number of likes, hearts, upvotes, whichever, will win. It's that simple. You can even go ahead and tell your friends, family members, whoever to like the video just so that you can win the plushie. Doesn't matter to me. As long as you share it and people like it, it's all good. I will also be picking a random winner from all of that. So don't worry if you don't think you'll get the most likes as there's still a chance to win. The random winner will be getting a Traveler Pepe plushie straight from the Blizzard store. It's not as great as your main character turned into a plushie but hey, who doesn't want a nice stuffed Pepe? And you can even like put these goggles down on his face and stuff, so cool. And that's all I have for you guys. Again, thank you very much each and every one of you that's ever interacted with this channel in one way or another, whether it be watching the videos, subscribing, sharing them, leaving comments, anything. You are what keeps me going and putting in the hard work to get these videos out. And I really couldn't do it without you. So at this last part, I just want to personally thank a few individual people that have been commenting really positive stuff on the channel. So here we go. First, we have Alexander Aramarki. You've commented a lot on the channel and your posts are always very constructive and well written. So thank you very much for that. Looking forward to your comments every time a video goes up. Next, we have Araya. You seem like a really nice and happy person. Always looking forward to reading your comments and thank you again for being the 90th subscriber. We also have Karthi. Interesting name, you spelled Karthi with double letters all the way. Thank you for the comment about the video quality, I appreciate it very very much. We also have 
easy grin. Lots of comments by you too. They are well thought out and they are nicely written. So thanks very much for that. Next we have Eduardo Menendez. That's a nice name. It rolls off the tongue nicely. Thanks very much for your comments. It's short but sweet. Next we have Epic the 112. You've been leaving a tremendous amount of comments on the channel and it's been a real pleasure to reply to them. I really like the small animal emoticons that you use. Whenever I see them, I know that it's you. So thank you for that. Eric Johansson, thank you very much for your encouraging comments. It's words like yours that keep me going with the editing, no matter how tired I get. So I really couldn't give you a bigger thank you. First name, lots of stuff from you too. Great constructive comments, adds a lot to the discussion and thank you very much also for the encouraging words. George Benedict, you left some really great comments on two of my AWK videos. Seems you are very much an AWK fan and I hope to see you playing one when BFA hits. Grow Hopeful, I'm assuming you main a warlock based on your profile picture. Your name kinda sounds demonishy too, like it could be a Felguard's name. Grow Hopeful. Thank you very much for your nice comments. It's always a pleasure to make videos for you. Guitar Keyboards, you're from Singapore. Very happy to meet a fellow Singaporean. So few of us left on WoW nowadays and even though you're not playing WoW right now, you're still watching my videos and I appreciate that very very much. Hi Overlord Snarfy Beagle, you are by far my favourite name on the channel and your icon looks just epic. It's a beagle with a viking helmet. Thank you very much for your comments, always happy to see them and they're nice and to the point. Immortal K Dude, thank you so much for your encouraging words. You've been posting a massive amount on the channel too. Whenever I see your comment, my face just lights up. So thank you for brightening my day too. Jam Jam, you only left two comments so far, but thank you very much for spreading your positivity. We need more comments like yours. Jane Amis, Ames, sorry if for my pronunciation, I must personally give you a shout out. You seem like an amazing person and you even defended me against some arguably racist comments. Thank you very much for that. You also mentioned that you were having some trouble with the mage tower about a month back. I do hope you've been able to conquer it thus far. If not, don't fret, there are still several months before BFA hits. Jordan West, I think you discovered my channel about a week back. Thank you for both the constructive and positive comments. And I am looking forward to seeing your name more often in the channel. Joseph Sanderson, thank you also for the encouraging comment. Stuff like that really makes a big impact on me to know that you guys are enjoying the content. Laughing Sage, I love your dog in the picture. It looks really adorable. Your comments are always very nicely written and are full of joy. I appreciate them very much and thank you for them. Marina Seda, Seda? You were one of the first few people commenting on the channel, so I can't thank you enough. Your positive critique has always been great. Thank you very much for the encouragement in the very early stages of this channel. Mega Chicken Fish! I love the name, I love your profile pic even more. You've commented super a lot too, and your comments are always great to read. You always bring in these very relevant quotes, which I really dig. Thank you very much. Michael Kofi, you are always thanking me in your comments, but in fact, I should be the one thanking you. So really, thank you Michael, for your comments, for watching the videos, for interacting with the channel, for everything. Michelle Amrich, I love you so much, you commented twice about how you're upset that I don't have more subscribers. Thank you very much for that, your words mean a lot. But it's alright, as long as you guys are enjoying the videos, whether it's a hundred subs or a million subs, I'll find a way to keep doing them for you. Nicola Prisik, Pricks? Sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrongly, but really awesome post, well thought out and it really adds to the discussion. I personally can't wait to read more of your stuff and thank you for all the comments. Prince Stormstrider sounds like the name of a torrent shaman. Stormstrider. Your comments are just great, full of detail and well written. Always a pleasure to read your posts and thank you very much for them. Sindra Gozia, interesting name, sounds like a potential brother of Sindra Gosa. Lots of comments from you two, thank you for all of them. Always puts a smile on my face when I see your name, you deserve lots and lots of hearts from me. 
Sophia, you sound like a really nice person. I know you were hoping for the Valpera to be perhaps a neutral race. Unfortunately, doesn't look too much like that's going to happen. But hey, you never know, it's still alpha, so things can happen. Still, thank you very much for your comments. I appreciate them very, very much. Sumerian88, loving all of your comments and thank you very much for the encouraging words. It will always be a pleasure to edit the videos to a higher quality so that you guys have a better viewing experience. I mean, you are spending your time watching the videos. It's the least I can do. Always a pleasure to see your name pop up in my notifications. TVA, cool name. Are you related to DVA, the Overwatch hero? Quite a few comments from you two and all very constructive. Thank you very much for them. Next we have Tegan. Great comments from you too. Thank you for the encouraging words. Even if it might be a short, simple sentence, it does have a big impact on me. So I appreciate it very much. Wise Burger. You said that I sound like Law Walker Cho, so I guess I just made your wish come true with this panda hit. Hope to see more of you on the channel and thanks very much for your comments. And lastly, we have Yazan. I love your comments so much. Every time you leave one, it makes my day a little bit brighter. They are either very well detailed or short and sweet. Thank you for all of them. I appreciate them very, very much. Again, I may have missed out on some of you. I sincerely apologize again if I did. It's a very messy process to look through all of the comments in each video one by one and to figure out manually who has been commenting the most. I wish YouTube had a better process to sort comments, but as far as I know, they don't currently have one. As a last note, best of luck to all of you in the giveaway. Again, I'll be leaving the full details in the description below, so be sure to check it out. I can't wait to turn one of your main characters into a plushie. A big thank you to each and every one of you. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in Azeroth.